Yeah, look, okay, how is this different? Well, let me see the other one and I'll tell you if they're different. <laughs> the nipple's out. Oh, oh. <laughs> Smuggling raisins. I can't believe you work with me every day and I look like this and you have not f***ed me. <laughs> it's not for lack of trying. Not for lack of I'm trying! Me over. <laughs> the big titted weirdo lady. Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. What happened? So Are the cameras rolling? Yeah. Oh no, you <laughs> got the, the skin caught the, the zipper caught the skin. Yes! Okay. He zipped my Adam's apple. No. <laughs> no ma'am. Pete just got a right when it hurt me too. Hi, I'm the Southern Ninja play Katana Hot Tin Roof, Trixie Mattel. And I was the star of the sleeper hit, Fiddler on the Roofie. Bet Middler on the Roof. <laughs> oh, Katya. <laughs> and welcome to... <gasps> oh, the show where we talk about whatever we like. Because it is our show, darling. And not yours. Encore. To the theater. Oh, Ampo, Zampo, Zampo, Zampo. All right, places, places, places. Uh, 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 thank you, five. Girl. Thank you, five. Thank you, five. You need to calm Screaming down. Screaming it. Oh, God. I, I no longer participate in theater. No. Except for the fact that I perform in theaters for a living. That's different. Yeah. But, in the theater of the absurd. Yeah. Where, where do we start with theater? How do we have this? Okay, well, here we go. First of all, life's a play. Everybody has a role. What is it? What is it? What is it? Shakespeare. What is that quotation? All Life's a play and stage. everyone has back rolls. Oh. <laughs> All the roles of the stage, everybody has back rolls. Back yes. rolls. Yes. I mean, uh, listen, my theatrical experience is uh, a little on the fringe. Like, off, 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 Broadway and off the rails theater. Yeah. You ever been to those? No. You've never been to Sleep No More? What the f is that? Let me see. You. This sounds like another cult. No, 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 no. So it's immersive theater, like, mm. and it's, they set up all these tableaus. I walked into this room, all dark, except the corpse of a deer in the corner. You never did like, wicked. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, like, I hate that. Oh, really? I hate musicals. I hate it. You hate musicals. There I go. I'm walking over the side of the stage to get some baguette. Ugh. God, just say it. Just say it. What a day, the sun is shining and I feel so good. Well, in defense of musical theater, and by the way, I went up, I, well, I liked music, right? <laughs> I liked music, I'm taking you back. I liked music. Okay. I'm 18 years old, I get to school for music. Then I go, oh, musical theater looks fun. It's like singing and then comedy. That looks fun, right? Lo and behold. By the time I get that degree, I know I don't want to do musical theater, yeah. but I'm stuck in it. I'm stuck in it. I will say this, Learning to move my body, learning to act, learning to sing. Hasn't happened yet. But look, <laughs> look where it got me. Yeah. No, I mean, I you... think I'm gonna like it here. Yeah, pop, squish. <laughs> well, there wasn't a green basement option at my college. You are doing what you set out to do uh, with your college degree. And yeah. getting paid handsomely for it. A, a beautiful, I mean, beautiful. exciting. I, bought, I could buy my college. No, you couldn't. No, I couldn't. No. You know what I could do though? I could give up a crazy amount of money and demand and a bench or something. A bench or like a nice uh, awning. An yeah, awning. or like a vending machine awning. where everything's free. That would be great. Or like a vending machine where everything was $25. Oh, that would be maybe that's my contribution is there's a vending machine that you pay me to use. It's really a business. <laughs> it's really a business. Um, you know what I don't like? What? When people do movies and it's a very transparent ploy to get an Oscar. Oh yeah, Oscar bait, Mama. Oscar I hate bait. It. I think it's I think it's cheap and lousy. Just go do a movie and do a good job, and I'll decide if you get an Oscar. Also, by the time that that uh, movie is in contention for an award, you're moved on. You should have moved on. You should have moved on. Should have moved on. Like like when eighteen months of her pretend shock when she gets awards. Give me a break. <sighs> you mean. You mean wait, you liked wait, it? Wait, hold on a second. It's too much. Well, yeah. Like she was discovered yesterday. You're nominated. There's a chance you could win. Prepare a f speech. <laughs> like and have someone write it to you. And don't you thank God. Don't you don't thank you God. Don't thank God. And don't you name someone that I'm not familiar with because guess what? I, I love I just, I didn't have anything prepared. Uh, the first person I want to thank is Steven. 
Like, just, Steve, Steve, Bob, Bob and Ross. Like, uh, they just, who, like, who? oh, oh my God, wow. I just, I, I was, I was, I'm a little emotional. I, I just never thought in a million times, I don't know the one if I die. What? You know what I would do? You're a world-class and actor. And Tony goes to Trixie Mattel, I would go, I just, I wasn't ready. I just wanted to say, her right in the, <laughs> I look right at the camera and just let that out. And they would not have time to cut. And it would be like Sally Field talking about if women ran the world, there would be no wars. And they tried to cut her off. But me going, her right in the, and I was, they would not be able to catch me. And I'll be on TV saying, Bitch. Shut, oh my God, that, okay. So oh. give me a Tony and I'll do it. When I get famous enough to have paparazzi, they'll be like me leaving the 7-Eleven. They'll be like, Trixie, how do you feel about season six on? Uh-uh. I'll be like, her right in the, like, uh, 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 every paparazzi shot is gonna be me like this. <laughs> like. Now, uh, and please welcome to the stage the winner of the Nobel Peace Prize, Ms. Trixie Mattel. No. In- her right- <laughs> Inside the actor's studio, be me and Daniel Dave Lewis, and he'll go, so, when you were voicing the Shrek 6, Puss in Boots, the pussy's back. How did you know to take your character? I'm gonna go, well, thank you for asking. What I did was, I f***ed her right in the (laughs) (laughs) You would never be able to stop me, ever. Now, let me say this. I gotta tell you about some of my theater teachers. Do you have like Stanislavski and all that stuff? Yeah. Okay, tell me. I gotta tell you about my theater (laughs) teachers. Uh, Theater acting teachers are what you think they'd be. She would wear a stretchy all black form fitting, long scarf. She'd walk into class at least 10 minutes late every day. The door would open and she would not look at any of us and go, why isn't anyone rehearsing? <laughs> then she would sit down and she would go there and open her book and then she would sit there. And we'd all be behind her and she would go, who's going first? I love that. Like, That's like, great. Like, like she's coming from a Hollywood movie shoot yeah. and you have 45 minutes to do your little uh, peanut butter play from um, your good man, Charlie Brown. Yeah, and the class is self-directed. I think that you would be good in a lot of different types of plays. In the future as an old, disgusting creep. In drag? Out of drag. Mm, in drag. No, out of drag. Creepy. Yeah, no, villain. in drag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trite. Uh, derivative. Girl in the front row, you should be moved to the back row. And girl in the back row, you should die. The principal actress will be played by a jar of peanut butter tonight. Yeah. Dance theater. Do you know about dance theater? So a dance recital? No, 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 no. Like dance theater. It's called dance theater. I understand what no, you're no, saying. No, no, I can no, hear I, you. No. I don't know what you're saying. So it's not quite. It's not quite dance. Uh-huh. It's dance theater. Oh. <laughs> so it's theater, but dance. <laughs> yes, exactly. Are you talking about like moving out? Nope. Uh, maybe. Stomp. So, I don't know. It's, um, I'm talking about German dance theater in particular. Okay, so just say that. Okay. <laughs> but so it, there's a lot of dancing, but it's very theatrical. <laughs> Are you trolling me? You're just saying the words dance theater in new formations and giving me no new information. It's dance theater, so it's theater with dance. And they're so, dancing, but like theatrical, it's theatrical dancing. Dancing, yeah. I did, have I mentioned that the theater is very dancing? No, Dead. I love all dance, except uh, lyrical. What is lyrical? Do you want me to demonstrate? Yeah. Thank you for attending tonight's performance of the American, what is it? Lyrical. Uh, lyrical. American Lyrical Dance Theater, featuring the talents of Katja Zamanach Gabon. No, <laughs> it's something like that. Are the jugs normally this big? Oh, it's usually like. Yeah. It's very like, it's very um, like, like uh, melodramatic, um, stupid and awful. In a lot of like, uh huh. <laughs> oh, it's really cool. Um, <laughs> that was a really good demonstration. <laughs> I, if you would like to see us, we have a very exciting show called Trixie and Katya Live, a 90 minute theatrical experience touring the United States. Oh my God, speaking of theater, that's we're, true. We are literally about to in- embark on a true theatrical event on a great scale. Yeah, I mean, when I think of us having to learn all of the songs. All the and songs. The dancing. Choreography, uh, lines, stage directions, uh, costume changes, quick changes, um, sex changes, all this stuff. It's going to be crazy. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. But you know what, though? Six, seven shows in, we'll be like on autopilot wanting to kill ourselves. Oh. 
That's when we put the thumbtacks into it. the shoes just to feel something. <laughs> That's when I start um, showgirlsing myself with pearls. <laughs> yes. Just to, just to like add mouth, some excitement. To choke. <laughs> yeah. Come see our play, Trixie and Katya, live. Real lines, real action, real scenes, real sets, and real dancers, dancers costumes, yeah. costume changes, yeah. plot points, videos, Beginnings, audience interaction. I, I have an idea for that, by the way. Okay. You know what I think the most stressful job would be? What? A dresser. A backstage oh dresser. Oh my god. Could you imagine Bernadette Peters, the, 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 the zipper is stuck, and she slaps you to the ground. Fire. Don't come back. Yeah, get get the off the plate. I don't know why. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's stressful. Have you ever had that happen to you? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, uh, a oh, moment you were ago, just assaulted. Peter yeah. Yeah. Uh, slipped my throat. You know, they also say though that TV makes you famous, movies make you rich, theater makes you good. Good. Yeah. So I think like probably real performers aspire to at least do theater. Well, that's the it's the thing for the prestige for the um, the cred. For acting cred, uh, mm -hmm. Hollywood people go to Broadway. I, this is what I want for us. Okay. I want us to be able to do Broadway. I want us to be able to do a residency in Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. And I want us to be able to do the West End before we die. All right, I'll, I'll, how about Short we just engagement. do, like we'll do a Shakespeare in the Park two weekends in it, and that's it. <laughs> Tell you what, we'll attend Utah, <laughs> yeah. Utah Shakespeare Festival. Yeah. We'll buy tickets, <laughs> we won't actually go. We won't go, but I will buy them. How about we'll do a version of Cabaret called Taxi Ray? I would like to see it, you know? My version of it, uh, Cabernet, <laughs> and I'm just drunk. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, that's good. Cheers. That's good. What if, what if, what if we tease our show, Trixie and Katya Live, and the people come see it, and it's a word-for-word -word plagiarism death of, of a death of a salesman yeah. with a little to catch a rye, to, uh, no, to catch a rye or mocking. To kill catcher a mockingbird, catcher in the, catcher in the, the mockingbird. <laughs> <laughs> to kill a mockingbird, catcher in the rye. There's a queen in Chicago named To Kill a Mockingbird. Oh, that's good. One time I saw her fall off the stage through a table. <laughs> yeah. But you didn't catch her in the rye. Oh, you? no, we just watched. <laughs> we, me and, I think me and Kim watched and we were like, oh. I think Kim was like, oh, oh my, God. my God. And that's it. <laughs> yeah. That's all the help Kim Whoa. could offer. <laughs>